Hello guys, welcome to Zeratmas channel. I'm Zero Truth, and the one actually playing is Zero Truth. But I'm Zeratmas, and I'm watching. So we've decided to change it up a bit because he mostly plays top lane and, and jungle and jungle. And bot. I don't really play much in way of mid or support though. So and even then, I'm not a very good bot laner. Yeah, true that. So when we decide to pick other lanes, I guess it's uh, my turn to show you guys what I got. Because this guy means everything. Ah, uh, means all the things. So, we're playing some Celestial Shaco. The idea is to throw comets at the fools. Yeah, to all the comets at them. Comets oh. and daggers, and comets and daggers. So, of course, what we got <laughs> here is Comet, obviously, but also Mana Flow Band, so you can, you, you, you can throw more. More daggers, more power. More comets. I was going Celerity because one of the advantages of running Shaco is your roams. Your roams are pretty strong, so getting Celerity makes sure you can get to other lanes a lot quicker, which is always handy. Yep, and Scorch <laughs> for all that early game, er, early game poking. Early game poking. Now, personally, for the second tree, um, I was going Inspiration and Boots and Biscuits. The idea is if you can kill your laner, which isn't actually that hard with this kind of shotgun build. You poke them down pretty easily and you have pretty good engage. Magical footwear is really handy for you. Increase movement speed, increase roams. So you just try to not roam until you get this. And biscuits make sure that you are out poking the enemy person because they are going to try to poke you down too. So having some sustain can kind of cover you on that front. Well then you could also go into Dominion uh, get yourself some Sun Impact and Relentless Hunter, or Ravenous Hunter, or I don't know, Eyeball Collection. Like friggin', you have so go Dominion. The reason, oh, I forgot, didn't even mention this. The reason we go Comet is because when you hit them with your knives, it slows them, which almost guarantees a Comet. Not quite, but if they hesitate even slightly from running away from that Comet, they will get hit. I mean, like. Comets pretty well guaranteed when they don't have boots, whether or not you got a slower stun or whatever. But now, even when they get their first tier boots, bam, we got them anyway. You could go into precision and get triumph, which is always handy. And then I would probably go something like Coupe de Gras to get that damage so that you can finish them off early in lane. So, or you could go resolve, but let's just not. You could go resolve and go unflinching and font of life. Yeah, take both of those. So this <laughs> is what I'm going to be going. So uh, take a look. Take a hard, hard look. We'll see you guys in game. Yeah. Hello guys. Welcome to in game where we play some Shaco in the mid lane. Celestial, Celestial Shaco. Shaco in the mid lane. So, the idea here is to throw so many daggers that they either die or have to leave lane. Or both. Or both. We're up against an Echo. Now, melee champions are specifically good for this. Because, like, you're Shaco and you're a, you're just a bully. And it's kind of kind of <laughs> easier to bully melee champions than it is to bully ranged. Though I have outpoked a Victor once, I, it was mainly because I was dodging his lasers. So now you just have to do the same thing, but with Echo's Q. <clears throat> You awarded too early a colleague. <coughs> you awarded yep. too early. But at the same point, she wants to come back to her blue. So. Just get Yasuo to award it. True that, but it doesn't look like he was about to. Now. Ooh, press the attack Shivana. Nito. Pretty much what we have to do here is win early. Minions. Pretty hard, because. Yeah. <laughs> if. Uh, now, she could. She's our biggest chance for a comeback here. Well, so is Yasuo's gets good in the late game. This is my plan. This is pretty much how Yasuo works. Go 0-7 in uh, the laning phase and then carry your team in the late game. This is how it works. Alright, and uh, there we go with our first wacky whack. One thing that's nice about Shaco is you just put yourself behind the minions and you do a pretty significant amount of damage. Three deeps. Oh. oh, dodged, but I missed a minion for it. Hey, but you weren't poked. True Just think about all the minions he's missed. Gotcha. 
So you can tell this Echo is clearly enjoying Lane by the fact that he's not even bothering to get near his minions. <laughs> he's he, he realized quite early what this meant for him. Yeah. And now I can't be ganked. Don't use your Q in lane unless it's a guaranteed kill or you're getting ganked. Oh, I really didn't want Now go top. Come on, go level 2 gank top. You know you wanna. I'll wait until I'm level 3 and then I'll probably gank bot to be honest. But I told you to gank top. Why don't more people gank top? Ah. I, th I was behind him, but then I stopped. Oh, you got refillable plus Dark Seal, neat. Whoop. That sucked for me. Just a lot. Uh, don't get stunned by Echo. Don't get stunned by Echo. That's you know, I think Dark Seal is a really interesting item. Cause, uh... Go, 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 go! Oh, yeah. It's like, it builds into Magi's. Which is like, you use if you get ahead, but it's really good for when you don't get ahead. Because it increases your uh, potion duration. Oh, Shivana's in the top lane. That's good to know. Kali's also in top lane. And my little box, uh... Got UCS. Yes, it did. And because I go biscuits, it means I will out-sustain this guy. Didn't really dodge that. No, I thought I would. And now you're screwed. Ah, I clicked on the map! I clicked on the map! Run! Don't do that. Also, you gave them a free summoner spell. What's wrong with you? Man, this guy's bad at Shaco. I'm still winning lane. There's not much they can do about this. I mean, come back when you don't have any mana. Oh, then uh, that fellow also doesn't have any mana, so I guess that. That fellow has a lot less mana than I do. Ah. He's had to use it to CS. I have all. Oh no! I thought I'd do slightly more damage. Holy crap! This the CSing is very you're, panicking. You're way too stressed out, mate. Just I've calm been playing down. support. Okay. Just this is hard. calm down. Okay. Uh, no. Oh, you totally should have queued for the E. One second. If you had flash, it would have said flash for it. But like, whatever. Now the reason I took that trade is I was planning on backing anyways. Like a scrub lord who doesn't want a cannon minion. Also, ping his flash just to trick your jungler. Just to. Tr I don't feel like it. I don't really need the. Uh, First, where's yeah. there it is? Oh, Holy crap! Blind. I'd get a dark seal so that your biscuits are better. Sure, whatever. I don't see why not. Also, if you get a head in the jays. Oh yeah, he's got a corrupting potion now. Did he use one? Yeah. Oh wow, really? You hit him once and he already used his corrupting? Pretty smart, push the lane up and then uh, just back too. So that's not bad. Um, pretty bad for Akali though. Now he does have a lot of sustain, but it's not really working for him here. Just hit him a couple times. Use the boxes to wave clear. Hold it. There we go. Now because I'm holding it so close to my turret, this guarantees that I won't be getting ganked very often. He's backing, I'd push. Yeah, uh, that's true. <laughs> but the idea was to hold it close to. Oh, I'm not getting that one. Hold Only it close to. Oh. Yeah, do it! Oh, jeez. Calm down. Oh no, man, you're you're, you're kind of bad at this. Just pay no attention to any of my videos. I'd worn off. Uh, maybe not. He's not getting ganked. Oh. Warn off uh, Yasuo. He's level 6. All Yasuo's right. getting ganked. Warn him. Warn Yasuo, he's getting ganked. Thank you. Oh, I, I screwed that up. He was not playing as if he saw that shit, but that shit was clearly going to the tri bush. So. Uh, there she is. Where is she? 
Uh, Krugs. Uh, yep, got it. So Shivana is counter jungling Akali pretty well, which is nice to see that they're that good. Oh. Uh, which isn't like super good, but it's good enough to make me happy. Like, he can out push me, unfortunately. But uh, to be honest, that doesn't matter that much. Here it comes. Dodge the second part, and. Uh, and Akali's coming in. She has nothing. I have nothing. Yeah, you're not close enough to do anything there. Um, holy, what are you doing, hun? Jeepers, creepers. I have Ignite, so there's that. I, True that, and now he's used his ulti. True that. Oh, wait a second. Come on. You just need one more E. There we go. Dodge. He should not have gone back because it's pretty clear which one was real when one of them backs out of the stun. Yeah, pretty much. Ugh. Ugh. Sucks that he got a kill there, though. Quite, but at least a colleague got an assist on it, I think. Pretty Not. sure. Take this for some mobility. I'd get a blasting launch, wait for it. I can get this. That you can, that's probably better. Debatably, anyway. Kinda depends on what you want. So yeah. Like, go back to your shop. I'm curious about the ability power difference. Between this. Uh, cause you could got a blasting wand and so that's 40, 40. 20, so it's the same. But what about the other thing? Cause you got an Aether Wisp and then you could have also gotten a blasting wand. Uh, Aether Wisp. 30. Oh, it would have been more. You're 70. Right. No, because you, you have only had like, so cause you have the needlessly plus that, you're still technically having more AP through the needlessly draw by about yeah. 10. You have about 10 more AP in the way you did it. Oh, but okay. you missed out on movement speed, which gets converted into AP, so my brain hurts now. So my brain hurts. Yep, that's pretty It, it would have been oh. pretty much the same, anyway, either way you did it. AP wise, actually. So you would have been better with the Aether Wisp, because more movement speed. Aether Wisp blasting one. I've been like negligibly lower amounts of uh, AP. But you should have autoed it into a friggin' E. Can you do it to this one? Um, no? Holy oh, crap. Coming. I got other things I gotta worry about right now. Okay, Q's up. Um... I don't know where he went though. No, I'd pro- oh there he is in mid lane. I'd go get him. Uh, I don't want to use it to get over the wall. No, you don't. You're doing interesting pathing. He probably laughed assuming you were nearby. And you're not that close. And now he's seeing you so he might go back in. Oh, okay. I probably wouldn't have done that. Yeah, that was just close enough. Oh god, no, Oh, silly, that was dead. silly, I'm out. Yeah, there's nothing you can do for her now because you saw someone else there and you're pretty low. You won't be able to. Whoa. That might actually be able to kill me. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're his villain. He gets to do extra shoot damage to you. Keep giving him a couple here and there. So here's a question. You're going AP Shaco. Why? Uh, because it makes those do more damage. I mean, doesn't and AD also enhance your... Not to the same degree. Okay. So because you're a greedy bastard is what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, pretty much. I can't do anything. God damn it! I, I hit Q just as he was hitting me with that silence. 
<sighs> that really okay. frustrates me. I was like, I knew he was coming in. I was hoping to bait him a little bit and then get out of there. But it didn't work for me. <coughs> I knew he could kill me. Damn. Look at that, though. I do gotta start ganking bottom lane. Like I said, the point of this is to roam. Unfortunately, my lane's been a little bit pushed up. Uh, Probably because they understand that your attempts are at roaming. But anyway. Little neat thing about Akali, she can use her invisibility finger to jump over walls. And uh, just move a little bit, get over things in general. It's yeah. a small bit of teleportation similar to Shaco's, just not to the same extent. Like, doesn't go as far. Yeah. And you're not invisible just over time limit. Oh, okay. you're gonna die now. Oh, that hurt. Yeah, that's why. That's why you go AP. That was really hurt. Yeah, with AD, your clones actually do something. And that did no damage to him. That is funny. Yeah, that is kind of funny. So, yeah, Echo and, uh... Garen decided to do a lane swap. Figuring that Garen could probably better, uh... Fight True that. Echo. An enemy has been slain. However, Garen's push isn't as hardcore. Now, them killing Draven probably means that Draven's gone. They didn't kill Draven. They Not killed Draven. Draven. Uh, the other one. I'd wait till they push up. He might not be gone yet. But you do know he just warded there. Yeah. Or you just leave, whatever. I am going to leave, get these, and uh, head back to lane. Yeah, Draven was not coming back. I think he knew I was on my way. Mm. That's why he warded over there. Fair enough. So there was no point in staying. Instead, head back, get something, and uh, leave. Oh, Zoe. That's interesting. Ow! She knew where I was. Yeah, pretty decent predict, but... Whatever. I mean, you... Oh, shoot. I what you should have done was... You could have used your clone to avoid the status effect. Uh, well, no, I probably would have still got stunned. Uh, just because... I'll try that next time. I still think I would have got, gotten put to sleep. But I potentially... Pretty sure you wouldn't have. It's hard to say. It I like is. It avoids things during that time, but status of, that status effect was on me already. Right? True that. Though, as he's going to stun, uh, silence me, using the clone could have worked. You were still... Uh, Sleep though. Uh, okay. there, there wasn't anything you do about him killing you once you were asleep, but you potentially could have avoided the sleep by uh, ulting. Man, he's fast. He is very fast. You are just randomly oh. autoing things. Not gonna hit me with that. One, two, and two. You are not doing particularly well. No, I'm not. This is very unfortunate. This has been a weird game, though. Yeah. Let's see if we can. Uh... Oh wow, that was. Did she? She got sleep. What? Vane went to sleep no, first. No, she didn't. Split us the seconds. Oh, she didn't. She was never hit by a sleep. A minion was instead. Oh, nice. His clone went to sleep. Ignite him. Maybe not a necessary ignite, but like, it was necessary. What? So close. Oh, yeah, got her. got her. Scorch, I imagine, finished. Yeah, it. probably. This will take the turret aggro, unfortunately, but uh, it slows down the minions slightly. 
I mean, unfortunately, it'll take a turn aggro. I mean, well, that's like one to... less shot on a minion, which means one more shot you guys had. True that, true that. But at the same point, could have just slowed down the minions, which would have been nice. Well, I mean, instead it did both. Get some of that. Highlight. Lie uh, injuries, I would suggest. Uh, that's not a bad idea. Especially since your main damage source is already a slow, and it does double damage against slow targets. Or, I can't impaired. kill him without my ult. I already know that. Also lacking a couple items. An enemy has been slain. Oh, he uh shut down. You care not for your clone. You can't even poke him all that well, holy balls. If he hits me he will heal up most of that. He's only got one vampire except you're probably fine. Let him go. Damn. It's okay. Uh, it's okay. Yeah, you can't really poke him because he heals too much. You need an executioner. Honestly, probably better that Vane got it than you. Probably, we really need her to get uh, popping off. Pop. Yeah, exactly. I do really like Shaco Mid. I've played it a bunch of times already to see how good it is. And unless. There are some obvious uh, downsides to it. Like. If you're up against somebody much, much pokier than you, there's nothing you can do. And uh, this Echo was playing super safe during the time that I could kill him. So, we couldn't kill him. But, either than those little things... Come on, dead. get there, get there, get there, get there. Told you, dead. Whoop. Echo wasn't really paying attention to his uh, alt placement, I imagine. He was probably trying to hit his, uh, his, his stun, but whatever. Poor guy. Now your wave clear as AP Shaco isn't the greatest. Unfortunately. Yeah, cause you're bad and you grab a friggin' Hydra. Where's yo tie him at, mate? It's not a very AP Shaco if you go tie him at. Yeah, it is. There should be an AP tie him at op option. That would be entertaining. Freaking hilarious. I think they need more auto attackers that scale AP. An enemy has been like seen. Diana. I'm gonna put this sort here of. to make sure that this is a slow push in our favor. Unfortunately, I didn't get that CS. <laughs> okay, uh, there we go. Blasting one, soon we'll have our Lyandries. Yeah, we're doing well. Nice. Like, we're not. We're not negative, and we're helping feed her, which is the important part. A couple times now. Pretty much everyone on your uh, team's positive. Now, I like what this Yasuo is saying. He's wrong, though. Uh, keep that in mind. He isn't correct on this. It is not over yet. I'm going to be honest, it pretty much is. It Unfortunately, because they have tanks... But, as long as they're being salty, it's over. I mean, Vayne says no to tanks. So you're pretty well good there. No, he just two shot of that before we were. Although, theoretically, I guess, because uh, Siobhan is really strong, she could just uh, drop Vayne before any tank busting happens. Let's ignite him. Literal suicide. Yep. Come on. Come on, my little guy. Yeah. Can we get Vayna Pentakill? No, it looks like, looks like someone's uh, AFK. Oh, They're well. They're Draven. Oh, he's bot. Bot lane. 
destroyed. Do, 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 I don't think he's always do, trying to blame do. bot. I think they're pointing out that Draven is bot. Your team has destroyed a and over the Nexus. Did you? Give him a nice little GG. Now, I'm not going to do as much damage as Vayne did. Unfortunately, she or popped. Probably up. even Yasuo or Akali or Lulu. I'm going to be honest. Shaco. In my last game, I did the most damage on my team, uh, which was awesome. But at the same point, awful because we lost that because nobody else on my tam team could do damage. Yeah. Well, let's check out our d -d 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 damages. Once it loads, you know. Hmm. Screw waiting for the load. Yeah, pretty much everyone just did well in that. We didn't really have much of a chance. They weren't uh, gonna be able to win a fight. We did just over Lulu. Uh, but, mo well, comparative to most of their team, a lot more. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> uh, which is unnerving because, like, they had a Zoe. Sure, Zoe did second least damage on her team, but like, you know, whatever. Yeah. So that was AP Comet Shaco. Yeah, we pretty much showed off what it's meant to do. Yeah. Roman poke. Roman well. poke. Our um, roams weren't as on point as they could have been, and I'm guessing, you know, anybody who plays Shaco would be a little up, uh, upset by that, but, uh,. You know, whatever. Screw you guys. We don't even care. <laughs> Dino hole. Well, Hope you enjoyed. See y'all in the next one. Bye bye. Hey. Just watched a video that I myself had made with no help from Seer of Truth whatsoever. If you wish to see more of my content, on the right you'll find our most recent video. And if you wish to see something other than my most recent video, then go to the left and you'll see something else. Good times. Also, like and subscribe, as this year just whispered into my ear, all so strange-like. Bye bye